Hello guys, welcome back to the channel, or if you're new here, welcome to the channel. Today, we're doing the cost and tactics and play instructions for the 4 triple 2 formation. Let's get. To start things off, our defensive style is going to be constant pressure. That's right, we do not want them to land a clean pass, we want to be constantly on their toes. Our width is going to be 5 and our depth is going to be 7. Our width is crucial here. We want to stay as compact and sturdy as possible at our backline, making it difficult for their attackers to run in behind us or even cut a pass for us. And for our depth, we want to push them high up the pitch and press them, win the ball back and a counter attack. Long ball is going to be our offensive style. No matter what formation you're using, ultra defensive, ultra attacking, always use long ball. It's by far the most major offensive style post patch. Our width for our attacking style is going to be 7. Now again, we want to exploit them wide areas and make it difficult for their fullbacks. Our players in the box is going to be 7. We want to get them goals no matter how it goes in, a tap in, it doesn't matter as long as we get that goal. Our corners and figures are going to be 3 and 1, you know how we do it around here. Again, the 4 2 formation, one of my personal favourites in the new game. Instructions Our striker is going to have the following. Balance width, get in behind, normal interceptions and stay forward. As you can see, Rashford and Warner both have that on them. Moving on to our cams, they're going to have the same again. Base defensive support, get into box, stick to position and cover normal interceptions. And as you can see, my Maradona has that as well. And with our CDMs, they're going to be different. One, the more attacking ones, going to have cut passing lanes, get forward, normal interceptions and cover centre. And for our more defensive one, he's going to have the following. Cut passing lanes, stay back while attacking, normal interceptions and cover centre. Moving on to our fullbacks, they're going to have the same as always guys. Stay back while attacking, default default. And for our centre backs, they're going to have the same as always, default default. Moving on to the goalkeeper, undoubtedly the player with the best instructions, comes to the crosses and super keeper. If you do not already, I definitely recommend using this. This basically means your goalkeeper is going to be more aggressive, catching the ball off corners on free kicks and punching the ball out and even slide tackles the striker when he's running in behind our defence. And it's really, really useful guys. He saved me so many goals and I really recommend it. Anyway guys, that's the tactics and instructions for the 4 triple 2 formation. If you did like the video, make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below your favourite formation in FIFA 21 and what instructions you use. And yeah, have a nice day, have a nice week and goodbye.